school for the right job. Come join me every Saturday at 7 a.m. to find out what makes me say, now that's clever. We use goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing ingredient. People really do notice the hydration of their skin. The farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802. It's our spring home and outdoor event going on all day today here at HSN. I'm Tamara Hooks, and I'm glad that you're shopping with me this afternoon. So I just wanted to give you a quick sneak peek of what we've got coming up at the end of this hour. Um, because we've got our today's special, we've got some flowers that we're going to talk about. But ice cream, you scream, I scream, everybody scream. Is that the, t I don't even know. <laughs> but we're gonna be talking about Kitchen HQ has this great one and a half quart ice cream maker. And it makes ice cream, let me tell you, in up to 25 minutes. Sorbet or ice cream in between 15 and 25 minutes. So it is the fastest ice cream maker I've ever seen. It's easy to use. We're gonna give you all the details. It even comes with a recipe book that gives you ideas of different kinds and flavors of ice cream that you can make. It's less than $30. And I tell you, if by the end of dinner you say, you know what, I could really go for some ice cream, okay, by 25 minutes later, you are eating your own homemade ice cream. And it's coming up at the end of this hour, but you don't have to wait for us. If you wanna order it, you can choose either black, red, or teal. We'll give you all the details in a full presentation, under $30, and I hope that you can hang out with us because it's gonna be good, okay? All right, well, we are gonna start off officially this hour with our today's special, and you're seeing it right there, right behind me. It's from Wind & Weather. It's been super popular. It's our great today's special. brand wind and weather brings us the solar led metal flower wind spinner and isn't it so pretty so it's solar powered because you've got um, light that is built in and during the day that solar panel that's right there in the center of that flower will soak up all the light from the sun and then in the evening when the lights go down when the sun goes down the lights come on your wind spinner so beautiful when it's spinning beautiful when it's night and even even beautiful when it's just standing still. That's why these have been so popular. They're already customer picks on hsn.com. They were $40 more, but today we gave it a today's special price, which means only for today can you get this for $89.95 or use any major credit card, spread the payment out four payments of $22.49. Now, we've got one going along in the back of our studio. That's the bronze color. And we have wind on it so that you can see when it's really windy and when it's really moving, how beautiful and mesmerizing it can look. That's the bronze. But we also have it in the multicolor that you see right here. This is just as stunning, but very, very limited. I'm showing you all around because you're actually getting two rows of those spinners and both have the solar panels, both have the lights. So it's gonna look good from every angle in your outdoor space. We only have about 900 left though in this multicolor. So if this is the one you want, I wouldn't wait too long to get it. So multicolor or bronze for one day only, I want you to go for it. And Yvette Lopez is joining us out, uh, Skyping outside to give us all the details. And Yvette, is it still raining out there? Oh, so. I'm, I'm dancing in the rain because I can't sing. So <laughs> <laughs> it's a wind and weather kind of day, but you know what? Look how beautiful my spinners look. I figured if they can withstand the elements, so can I. <laughs> they are wind and weather's most popular spinners. You can clearly see why. They stand over six feet tall. I'm five six, so you can clearly see that. You can stake them in the ground, like I have them here. You can put them in a planter, like you have them there. So if you have a grand backyard, or if you have just a little patio or a lanai, that works too as beautiful vertical decorating. But what Wind & Weather has done here is not only do you have the beauty 
and the artwork of these spinners, but you also have the technology that you spoke about. So right here, this is a solar panel. It is integrated on both sides right into the design of the spinner. That way it doesn't take away from the design. Right in there, there is a solar battery that is included. All you do is turn the on switch on. When the lights go down, you're gonna have a fantastic light show. There are nine lights on one side, nine lights on the other side. They even put lights on the back of the spinners. So when they light up, you're gonna get the light show from absolutely all angles. And I want you to notice this spinner head spins around this way as well as bi-directionally with the two blades. So, wow, wind and weather really outdid themselves on this one. They really <laughs> did. And I, I will tell you, um, if this is your first time seeing our Today Special for the day, maybe you're on the West Coast and you kind of just tuned in for the day, we welcome you in for sure. But these have been very, very popular as a Today Special today. We are down to fewer than 900 in the multicolor. So if this is the one that you love because it's very, it's bright and happy and vibrant and that's what you're looking for, I don't want you to wait too long because fewer than 900 and that's gonna be, that's gonna go very quickly. The rest we have in a bronze which I think is always stunning and it works with every decor. So either way you wanna go, I wouldn't wait too long to get them. Just so you know, we have them staked in a planter because we are inside, because as you saw with the vet, it's raining outside. So, um, and we don't have any dirt in here. Normally we would just stake them right into the ground. The planters do not come with the Today Special. Just so you know, I just want you to know what you're getting when you get home but they are stunning. That might give you an idea. If you don't have a big backyard or a grassy space to put them, you could put them in a planter or in a pot and put them on your balcony. How beautiful would that be? So it just gives you other options. I also like that this is maintenance free. There's nothing you have to do. There's no upkeep. You don't have to water anything. You just put it in and let it be beautiful. And when the sun goes down every day and those lights come on, it's just a stunning sight to see in your, you know, in your, um, in your environment. Look at this. So we've got, we turned our lights down here in the studio so that you could see them as they're moving around. I think it's gorgeous and a, an easy today special that everyone can enjoy. So four flex of $22.49. And Yvette, I like that as, you, as we're showing the light, there's just during the day, during the evening, whether it's windy or not, these are just a stunner. They really are. And you know, wind and weather, their passion is outdoors and their mission is to bring their customer distinctive decor and something that other people aren't going to have. You just can't pick this up, um, you know, at your local home improvement store. This is something I think you would find at like an art festival in a, in a large city. And I want to show you not only do they have the technology and the, the, you know, the artfulness about them, but they also are, Wind and Weather has them to such a high standard of quality. These are all powder coated. And it's very important when you're talking about outside decor, powder coated means it's a pigmented powder that actually cures to the metal by thermal bonding. They are not gonna chip, they're not gonna rust, and they're not gonna fade. My, these are actually my two spinners that I have here. I've had them out since December and I live in Florida. So we get a lot of this rain and we get a lot of sun and look at how vibrant and gorgeous they still look. Yeah, they are. And at yours look as vibrant as our brand new right out of the box ones that we have in the studio. And that is a big deal too, because when you are bringing something in your home to beautify your home, you want it to stay beautiful. So when you look at these, and these are strong and sturdy, they're not flimsy in any way. I can't bend them, I can't, you know, or, any, or anything like that. So you've got a nice, strong, sturdy metal, powder coated, there's your solar panel on the inside, which I like that it's not a separate piece, it's just part of the decor and part of the design, and you've got that solar panel on both sides. So there's no good side, there's no right side or wrong side to this. It's just stunning from every angle. It stands over six feet tall. Um, and so you can see for vertical 
uh, decoration, how beautiful it would be. We have ours in the back next to a, a very tall tree or a tall plant. So you can see it gives just a lot of presence. Oh, look, I can, look, I can hold it. <laughs> it gives just a lot of presence when you have it in your home. For one day only, it's a today special. We took $40 off the price of this one. You were showing it to you there in that bronze, but this may be the last full presentation of the multicolor. How many of these do we have left? 700 left in the multicolor. And if you have, Yvette and I were talking last hour about around your home, maybe it's around your backyard area, where you just have that area where it's like a dead space. There's, we, in my home, we've got an oak tree so the grass doesn't grow there because it just never gets any sunlight. Uh, maybe nothing grows in that corner, but you still want to bring some beauty to that area in your yard, in your garden. This would be something perfect to add. Yvette, do you agree? Oh, I so agree. I, I told you, I think you've seen my yard because <laughs> I do have that spot. And what I love about the multicolor one is it's a pop of color. I don't have to water it. So if it's a dead spot, it's okay. It's still going to look gorgeous. And speaking to your point earlier, um, I do want to show you how they go in the ground. So they, you're good. this is super easy to assemble. I assembled it pretty quick. All you need is a Phillips head screwdriver. And if I can do it, trust me, anybody can do it. Three pieces of the pole, your spinner head. Remember, the solar battery is already included. It's already integrated. You don't have to do anything there. But what I like you to see is you have this very sturdy pole, and this is a thick pole. You have that stake in the ground. Two more prongs are going in there. So you're gonna have a total of four prongs going in your ground. It's gonna hold that pole really sturdy. So when the winds get going, now this will start spinning with three mile an hour winds. But when the winds are going, let me tell you, it just spins around almost like a propeller. <laughs> the, the um, the multi one looks like a, a kaleidoscope, like when yeah. we were little kids that we used to look at. Yeah, I mean, it really, it's mesmerizing. That's the thats the term I keep using. And, yeah. um, and even the fact that, as you were saying, you just decide where you want it to be put in the ground and you don't have to do anything else. You don't have to bring it in when it rains. You don't have to bring it in when it snows because you've got, these are powder coated, so no worries there. You don't have to baby it in any way. This can be something that beautifies an area that doesn't, right now, doesn't have anything. Or maybe it draws attention to an area okay. where you spent a lot of time and energy on your garden, on your planting, on your flowers, and you want to bring even more attention to it to make sure that, you know, no one's don't step over there. That's where my planting is. These would be beautiful to draw attention in that way. Just so you know, this will very likely be the last full presentation that you see this multicolor because it's going fast. We've only have about 600 of those remaining. Over 6,000 of these have been ordered on the day. And that leaves just a few thousand of those left for the entire rest of the day. And it's only... I, I said it last hour, it's only lunchtime on the East Coast. So if you want yours, and I would say, depending on the size of your yard, you don't need five or, or 10 of them. One or two would be perfect um, because yes. they are so eye-catching and so sizable. And Yvette, I love to see you standing between them because it just really illustrates the height of these. Yes, remember, over six feet tall, they're two feet wide. And you know what, if you can, First of all, you're going to look for different places to put them. And what's neat is you can move them around. So it's not like they're permanent, which brings up another point. If you're renting somewhere, you might not want to invest all that time and maybe planting flowers and, and money. But this you just take right with you, you know. Yeah. Um, and what's neat is I, I want to remind you guys out there, Mother's Day is coming up. Mm -hmm. So what a fantastic gift to give your mom. Maybe you haven't seen her in a while. Um, maybe you have that you guys can ship it right to her. But every time she looks at this, she's going to think of you for sure. Yes, it says it brings a smile. And I was saying last hour, we were talking about Mother's Day, which is coming up next month. I believe it's May 10th. Oh, my gosh. It's coming up right? so fast. Today is April 24th. In literally, what, three weeks or so, it's going to be Mother's Day. And what I love is that you don't have to wait. You don't have to say, well, I'll get her something closer to the time. 
order it today, send it to her. She'll have it before Mother's Day and she'll be able to maybe take pictures in front of it and send it to you. Maybe if you don't see each yeah. other, if you can't see each other. You're, you're sending her beauty. You're not sending her a chore, something she has to go out and tend to if that's not her thing. You're sending her a smile. You're sending her ambiance, light and movement. And um, these are the kind of simple things that really can make a difference because we are spending more time at home and Yvette and I were talking last hour about now we're maybe paying more attention to our home space than we did before. I know I am. Mm -hmm. I definitely am. I've, I've noticed places in my yard that I don't think I really paid attention to before. Uh, I have a full house right now. My, my husband happens to be a first responder on the fire department. So you know what? We're, we're working from home. We're we're learning from home, cooking, eating, everything from home. We need to relax from home too. So I think it's very important that you have that space, that you can take a mental break and, and just relax for a moment. And you know, when you look at these spinners, you watch them, you have to mentally engage. Actually, your brain does, which means it takes a break from whatever else is going on. Yeah. And you can sit back and you can just relax and enjoy. They yes. really are fun. They really are. And just in case you're wondering, they don't make any noise. So even when they're None. spinning at their fastest, they're not making noise. They're not loud. They're not going to interrupt your, you or your neighbors or your thoughts or when you're out reading or when you're out just enjoying, you know, the view. They're not, they're not intrusive in any way. They're just designed to be beautiful. And, I and, I, and that's, I think, one of my favorite things about it is that they were designed to be as beautiful as possible. And in the past, we've seen uh, wind spinners for um, decor, but they were always very small. And you, maybe you have some, they're small. You can hang them from a branch or hang them from you know, a, a hook or something. And they're small and they're pretty. But the bigger and bigger and bigger they get, the, usually the more expensive they get, and usually it's tough to find those kinds of things. These are the kind of things that you would expect to see in a very expensive catalog where they would, the, they would be so priced out of reach. Today, these are our Today Special, and we'll send them straight to you. And Yvette, even the fact that we still have a couple of color options is a big plus. Yeah, you can see we lost two already. Yeah. But you know, if you, these are just gonna make that statement and that's what wind and weather is all about. They want their customers. They want you to have something different. And trust me, your neighbors will look at you because I've had these in my yard. I have had my neighbor's lawn maintenance person, the pool guy, the mailman, even even the Amazon delivery guy. Where did you get those? <laughs> you know? They People want to know where they come from. They love them. Yeah. So I have a lot of people tuning in today to pick these up. But again, not only during the day. I mean, they're just stunning during the day. But then the minute the sun goes down, yeah. the light show starts. Yes. And you're just you're going to have so much fun with these. <laughs> yes, you are. And it's so funny, as you were saying, all the people who comment, people notice when they see things that are just, they catch their eye. That's what it is. Just so you yeah. know, we've got, oh gosh, I think I lost track, 400, 400 left in the multi. And I'm telling you that I'm not trying to rush you because I don't like to be rushed. I just want you to know that. So if you're thinking about getting the multi, because that's the one that is just most beautiful to you. I don't want you to wait until too long because 400 can quickly go to 300, which can quickly go to none. So if you want to call us, you can. If you want to shop on hsn.com, you can do that as well. If you want a couple of them, maybe you already ordered the multi, you ordered one and you're thinking, you know, maybe I will put one in each corner of the yard. Whatever, whatever you want to do, don't wait until it's gone. Four flex payments of $22.49, free shipping. That's all for today. These are customer picks. If you want to read the reviews, please do so. And um, again, to Yvette's point, she's standing out in the wind and the weather right this second. And then it's going to be blazing hot at about, you know, 95 degrees before we know it. These are still going to hold up. Oh yeah, they definitely are. That's what they're made for. Remember, they're powder coated. Um, oh, you know, I wanted to mention because we love reading the reviews and actually everybody on the reviews always mentions the quality. But you know, one review stuck out to me where it said that um, they put this in their tomato garden. 
<laughs> to scare off the critters. Ah! And it worked. Oh, wow. It actually worked. And at the same time, they had some movement and some beauty out there. So how about that if you have some you know, uh, vegetables out in a garden. <laughs> oh, I love that. So modern day scarecrow. I'm all about yeah. it. I'm all about it. Yvette, <laughs> Yvette, thank you so much. I know we're going to see you throughout the day. Yeah, thank you so much. Bye. Have well, a great day, everybody. And let me just encourage you, if you want the multicolor, uh, Oh my gosh, 300 left. Oh, I'm getting nervous. 300 left. This might be the last full presentation that you see of that multicolor. Enjoy these. You can keep shopping for them by calling us or shopping on hsn.com. And if you do shop online, these are going to be the first thing you see right there on the homepage. You can just click and go ahead and get yours. All right. So let me just share with you. We've got so much more coming up in this hour, but I want to give you some information on some beauty, some skincare that we've got, and then come right on back for more. We understand every woman's skin is unique. We offer real beauty solutions for individual needs of real women, empowering women to achieve healthy, radiant looking skin. Backed by over 30 years experience, made from important ingredients combined with advanced science for affordable skincare that truly works. Change the story of your skin and your life forever. Genuine beauty begins with skin. It's important to let the people in your life know how much you appreciate them. So all this month, we're sending a little extra love your way. So thank you for choosing us. We appreciate you. And we're so happy, so happy, so happy that you're part of our family. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So we've got a lot going on this month here at HSN, Customer Appreciation Month. It is our spring home and garden and outdoor event, and we're glad that you're here for every minute of it. I'm Tamara Hooks, I'm your host, and if you're still on the phone for today's special, you can keep on shopping, but I've got more for you in this hour. So we're gonna turn our attention to our plants, our flowers, and we've got an easy, easy way for you to really nurture them and nourish them, and that's with Spray and Grow. What you're going to get, and we'll give you a full presentation, is the one gallon continuous power sprayer that we've got for you. What I love about this is that it's effortless continuous spraying. No hand fatigue where you're constantly having to pump the spray. You don't have to keep constant pressure on the trigger, you just spray. I'm not pumping anything. I'm not, my hand is not tired. I'm just spraying. It's that simple. We're gonna give you all the details. We do have a feature price here of $99.95. We've got FlexPay on this one as well. And Carrie Mobley, looking as beautiful as a flower, is standing <laughs> by. Hi, Carrie. Oh my gosh, it is so nice to see you. How are you, Tamara? I'm doing good, but I miss having you here. But I see that you are amongst the beauty of the flowers. Right, I am with my people, so to speak, right? <laughs> right. You know, it's so funny. I'm a neighbor of a vet, and so it's pouring rain here. I'm covered under my front porch, but please know she was working her tail off <laughs> during that presentation. <laughs> so listen, as a professional gardener, um, I want to tell you, Spray and Grow is that green thumb in a bottle. I've been using it for years. We have such fans on the Home Shopping Network. But what we are offering you today is outstanding. It is a one gallon jug of Spray and Grow, which by the way, any place you go, Spray and Grow's website, it's $99 all day, every day. But we are also including the one gallon power sprayer. So this is a $30 value. So the good news is you are getting this virtually at a cost for the same price as just that spray and grow. That's right. So here's the thing. What is spray and grow? Well, plants need a few things. Number one, they need water. 
Um, and everybody needs to know that. That's the most important thing. Here today, no problems with that. They also need fertilizer, but most of those plants can get that fertilizer from the soil itself. But what Bill Muskoff, the creator, the chemist, the gardener that created Spray and Grow realized is that those vitamins for your plants, those 17 micronutrients that Spray and Grow provides, that is that key. That's the green thumb in a bottle. We're gonna be showing you lots and lots of pictures that were sent in by our customers. So what can you use Spray and Grow on? Anything that's green and grows. A lot of these are with and without, before and after, but you said it at the beginning, Tamara, it's about <laughs> the ease of use. A one gallon jug, if you make this one gallon container, it's going to last you almost five years. Wow. So if you don't have quite as big of a property, maybe you just have some house plants or a couple tomatoes, maybe some shrubs, maybe some grass, it'll last you even longer. There is no shelf life on it. There is absolutely no expiration date. It's totally non-toxic. It's guaranteed to the bottom of the bottle and it is scientifically proven to give you more, bigger, and better. Here's how it works. You take two teaspoons of Spray and Grow and you mix it in with some warm water. You let it sit for about 15 minutes. You can see here we're using a smaller container with this one gallon. You're gonna be able to throw in a couple tablespoons. And once you let it sit, those micronutrients come to life. You spray it on anything that's green and grows. Flowers, perennials, annuals, fruits, vegetables. And it soaks right in and it gives you more, bigger and better more flowers, more fruits, bigger fruits and vegetables, sweeter fruits and vegetables. And it actually brings your plants to its full potential. You wanna talk about a green thumb? This spray and grow, it's green thumb in a bottle. Absolutely, and let me just share with you, um, if you, and again, use them anywhere for your indoor plants, outdoor plants, fruits, vegetables, um, whatever the case is, spray and grow. If you think about fertilizer is like food for your plants, spray and grow are like the vitamins for your plants. And those pictures that you saw of the with and without spray and grow, I wanna show you some more. And one thing that you should know is that those pictures were sent in by customers who are not professional gardeners or growers. They're just regular folks who oh, use spray and grow, and woo, this is what happened. Look at what you see here. These are, oh, okay, let me take a look at this. This is the first time uh, they use spray and grow, and they love it. It works great on their tuberoses. You can see right here. This is, they've been using spray and grow for 10 years. All of their plants were amazing, um, and they've used nothing else since. This is what we're talking about. These are the kind of results that we're talking about with Spray and Grow. Look at the, the with and the without. Do you see the difference in that grapefruit? That's when Carrie's talking about more, bigger, better. That's the more, the bigger, and the better. And we can show you results on results on results. Look at the size of those blueberries. Wow. I mean, Carrie, and it's so simple. Let me ask you really quickly, how often should I use my spray and grow on my plants and, and vegetables? So what we recommend, Tamara, is once every two weeks. Um, I will say that that's perfect. And you are still going to get that more, bigger, better. I, I use mine about once a week. You cannot hurt your plants with it. These are naturally occurring micronutrients and you are still going to get that more, bigger, better. I'm a fruit gardener, so I have blackberries, raspberries, I have cherries, I have strawberries, I have about a dozen fruit trees. So I am getting more fruits, more vegetables. Look at those tomatoes. Look at those tomatoes. And any of you who have been purchasing um, the leaf and petal flowers today, which are so stunning, just the simple process of simply spraying spray oh and grow 
oh my gosh, I, I'm sorry. That looks like a fairy tale. <laughs> and know. these, again, like you said, Tamara, these are not professional gardeners. These are people who just like to plant a few things and they believed in spray and grow. And you've got nothing to lose. It's yeah. guaranteed to the bottom of the bottle. And so what does that mean? If you were to use that entire gallon of spray and grow, and let's say it takes you five, 10 years, if you aren't getting the results that you are seeing right here as Tamara goes through these pictures, oh my gosh. you can return it yes. for a full refund. And we can do it because we know it works. Check out the reviews on yeah. hsn.com for real. Yes. I mean, that's what we're talking about. When you're when you're growing things, this is why we're growing. We want the we want the harvest. We want it to do well. We want them to be um, big beautiful flowers or big um, you know, succulent vegetables like this. And when it's this easy, why not? So, talk us through again, Carrie, what we're seeing. Sure. Yeah, absolutely. So it's a concentrate. So that gallon is going to last a long time. You mix it into your gallon jug, let it sit for about 15 minutes. And this is where the magic happens. Those micronutrients, they go right onto the leaves, the fruits, the vegetables. Remember, this is non-toxic. It soaks in using something called foliar feeding, which farmers have been using for decades. And that's where those results come in. Foliar feeding is up to 10 times more effective than feeding through the root because it doesn't have to fight that gravity. So then you spray it right on the fruits, the vegetables, and that's where you get the more, the bigger, and the better. It's guaranteed. And I am telling you, it is the secret to my success as a gardener. Like I mentioned, you're gonna use it about once every two weeks. If you make something a little bit smaller than that gallon, like we were saying, I have um, I have gardens everywhere, thanks to Spray and Grow. But if you want to use less of it and just make a quart, we do have some lines on this gallon power sprayer that you can see, oh, okay, I just want to make a quart. You can use it on house plants. You can use it on fruits, vegetables. I, got, I have to tell you, and I, I brag about this all the time, it kind of makes me look silly though. Um, <laughs> I mentioned my fruit, my fruit trees. So I would spray, and this is how easy it is, right? You just spray all over. I would spray my fruit trees and I started to notice the grass underneath my fruit trees was thicker. It was more lush, it was healthier. So even if you don't have fruit trees and maybe you haven't gotten into fruits and vegetables yet, if you have shrubs or maybe a patch of grass that isn't doing well, what Bill Muskoff realized is that these micronutrients will give your plants everything it needs to match its full potential. So the grass underneath, stunning. And you know what else? I started to realize, I'll spray all of my grass. Yeah. We, we say, once you mix it and those micronutrients become alive, we do say you need to use it within a few hours because they're living micronutrients, even though they're totally non-toxic, totally safe for you, your children, your pets. But if you finish, you know, everything that you have to do, spray your grass, spray your shrubs, spray your house plants. Mm -hmm. You know, another thing is, Tamara, during the holidays, if you have a Christmas tree mm. or if you have cut flowers and you spray them, it increases their lifespan. Ah. This stuff is unbelievable. I hadn't thought about that. That's a great idea. What? Carrie, thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you. It was so good sure. to see you, Tamara. You too. We'll see each other again soon. And just again, if you're going to get the big, the big one of your spray and grow, and then you're also going to get your continuous sprayer that you just hold and spray. Again, no having to pump nothing like that so super comfortable for you to use you've got it on three flex of thirty three dollars and thirty two cents that's the number to get that home about thirty dollars off of that price okay so now you're thinking okay well i love the idea of spray and grow i love the idea of sort of having vitamins for my plants but i do wish i had some new plants something to bring a little bit more life and energy into my home well that's where leaf and petal comes in we have a few items that we want to feature for you, and they're all very different, um, just depending on your taste. We've got the three-piece indoor-outdoor snake plants. 
And you're gonna get all three uh, different varieties. You're gonna get the Emerald, the Laurenti, and the Sansevieria. You're getting all of them. These are brand new to us, brand new to you. They add a beautiful architectural element to your home. These also help to filter toxins from the air, which is great. They help to absorb carbon dioxide. They release oxygen at night. And I love the height and the, again, that architectural look of these. And that's what these are, indoor, outdoor snake plants. We have them in beautiful pots here, but you can also plant them in the ground. You're getting all three varieties, one, two, three. Three flex payments of $13.32 and free shipping. And Rochelle Grayer is joining us via Skype to give us all the details on these. Rochelle, it's great to see you. You, Tamara. Definitely. Okay, so let's talk about the snake plants. Yeah, so you know what's so exciting about these snake plant is that um, these are one of those house plants that you really can't kill. Um, I used to work in... Uh, for a company that we put and took care of plants inside office buildings. And if you can imagine, those office building plants get just tortured. Nobody cares for them and nobody looks after them. And what we would always put in there was a very small handful of types of plants, but one of them was always the snake plant. And that's because it looks great. It stays nice and green and healthy, despite being literally ignored if you wanted to ignore it. It can be in a <laughs> low light situation, relatively low light. It's gonna want to be near a window, but it doesn't need to be near a window. Um, and it also is very uh, happy to be watered very infrequently. You really, <laughs> truly cannot kill these. So that's that's what's so exciting about it. But I have to tell you the other thing that is so cool about it, I didn't realize until I got my own here, I didn't know there were three in the sets. And you get not just the, the tall, skinny one, but you get the little rosettes too, mm -hmm. which is just so cool. I, um, I've actually never grown the rosettes. And they're just awesome. I'm, I'm excited to uh, transplant the two of them into one pot and, uh, you know, have a real kind of mix. I think that's going to look really great because oh. uh, one, of them, one of them has like a variegated edge and then the other one um, is more uh, just two, two shades of green, right. which is really kind of cool. So it really has some distinctive qualities here and you get three very different looking plants. Very true. So you just a answered well, one of my questions. So if I wanted to pop them a couple of them because you're getting three different three different varieties. If I wanted yeah. to put them together, I could. They don't have to be separate. No, no, I would, uh, yeah, and I would maybe uh, put the, put two, two or maybe even all three together. Yeah, you can, it's gonna make a more impactful um, sort of uh, display for sure because they are so different. Look at them, they, there's like a, the shorter variegated one and then a taller, uh, greener one and then with the tall, tall one, um, which by the way, I love this too. This plant has so many nicknames and, and most all of them are not very flattering. Uh, my favorite one is called mother-in-law's tongue. Um, <laughs> but I wanted to say, or the devil's tongue, that's another one. Oh my. Uh, but what I wanted to tell you is that these are actually um, considered good luck plants. Um, in China, these were uh, mm. plants that were often put by the doors of houses because it was thought that it would uh, bring all of the uh, gifts of all the gods into your house. And so it was, it was kind of like feng shui before feng shui was even a thing. Um, <laughs> these are so I, I think it's just so sweet in this time of um, corona and all this kind of stuff that we have something that we can pass along to each other as a good luck plant. Oh, I and love just, that. Uh, very sweet. And and healthy. Uh, that's the other thing. Do you know, I know you mentioned already that they take the toxins out of the air. One thing that they specifically take out of the air is formaldehyde. Uh, wow. Formaldehyde is something that um, you might have a lot of in your house if you have a smoker in your house or a lot of like pressed wood products like pressed wood furniture or countertops or whatever. And so those can off gas. And NASA did a study with a bunch of house plants, um, but this one, the snake plant, uh, which there's three here, uh, was the one that did uh, the best at taking formaldehyde out, which is, I think is so fascinating. Wow. That this is a plant that will really clean your air very actively. I like that. You know, there's. It's, I love to learn a, more about the plants because um, especially when you were saying, it does it, it can be watered infrequently. It wants water, but it can be watered infrequently if you forget to do it. It doesn't need a whole lot of light. So there, there are places in your home 
um, where these would be perfect. And they just give, there's something about a plant anyway that just gives a lot of energy to a room. It does. And the fact that it does so much. One other thing I wanted to share with you, and we only have yeah. about 400 of these left, is that when you order anything from Leaf and Petal, you're not going to get that little that small little stick no. that just gives you like two words of information. You get um, a, a great pamphlet that gives you information about how and to care for the plant, the best place to put it, where to, how to water, all of this. And I wanted to also share this with yeah. you as well, the shipping map of when these are gonna ship to you. And it really does depend on where you are in the country so that you can get it at the right appropriate time to plant it for yourself. So go ahead and pick up the snake plants. You're getting all three of them. And I think, you know what, Rochelle, that I'm gonna get a, a set of three for my own house because I love all of the benefits of I having those snake plants. Very nice. Okay, so we've got yeah. more for you. No, they're, they're great. Yeah. Oh, yes. And those are 695717. So Rochelle, we've got, a, a, we're gonna shift gears a, a little bit or maybe a lot <laughs> with, the three, okay. with the three piece of the pink mooly grass. Look at how beautiful yep. these are. So you're getting them for $24.50. You've got free shipping on them. And is, is this, okay, so talk, talk me through these because I've never yeah. seen this type. Yeah, so I have mine here at home. They're, you're actually getting three of them, but here's what one of them is gonna look like when it arrives. It'll be in this little pot and it I think we froze just a little bit. So this is what it looks like. Pine needles instead of like, so it is a grass. Yeah, yeah. and then and then as it um, grows throughout the summer, this is uh, a, a plant that's gonna be happy in a sunny spot. Um, it will throw out those uh, seed heads is what you're seeing that are so pink. Um, but the, also the leaves themselves will, or the, the fronds or whatever you wanna call these, uh, they'll also go to like a real pinky color as they age into the fall. And so that's where they get get um, their name from is the pink mully grass. And you'll see them a lot. If you're a Pinterest person, you see them all the time on Pinterest. They uh, are very popular to put around the front door. If you're like a pink person, they really are very interestingly pink um, in a way that you really don't see. I'm sorry, these things are going in my mouth um, <laughs> in a lot of ways or in a lot of plants. Um, pink and texture and just kind of this like really happy, frothy fro foam of pink, um, yeah. which is really fun. It's not a color you see in nature very often and certainly not a color you see in grasses. Um, what what you see on the set there is just a representation of what you'll get in the fall. It may or may not be quite that pink, mm -hmm. but um, it, you know, mine get um, maybe a bit softer than that, mm -hmm. um, but they still are very strikingly pink and they really are kind of uh, an exciting thing to have in your garden because they are really a focal point when they come into season later in the fall. Um, they're, so. they're just super cool. Like uh, definitely a, a talking point. You know, people are gonna ask you, what is that? You they know, are. The, and you'll say my pink milligram. <laughs> they are. You know what? You're right. Um, I think sometimes we do, especially in, in, in certain areas, we kind of get used to seeing the same kind of plants and flowers. And isn't it yeah. nice to be able to interject literally something so, so vibrant and something so different than what you see all the time? And you know what? These are, so you're going to get three of them. They come in their own little pot. Um, these are gonna, this is how it's gonna come like right here. Yeah. Yeah, and so right here, when you get it, you're gonna say, wait a minute, that's a little bit underwhelming. Yeah, just let it grow a little bit. <laughs> and you're gonna see what this yeah. grows into. Uh -huh. Yeah, you just, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm having a little hard time with the uh, the audio here, but uh, yeah, I mean, they will grow. These are, um, by the way, um, very, um, they are perennials in some part of the country. The further north you get, uh, they may not overwinter at the most northern areas of the country. So here in Boston, I actually tried them out last year. Um, I'm in the borderline kind of place. So I'm kind of excited to see whether or not they're going to come back. But certainly if you're zone six and below, you're not going to have any problem with uh, these being perennial plants for you. And they'll come back year in and year out, which is really great too. Oh, very nice on that. So we've got, you're getting three of them. You're getting a featured price. You've got three 
reflex of $8.17 to get them home. And if you are looking to interject just some life and energy into your garden, that would be a great option for you. And we're showing you some pictures of them and you'll see they do come or, or, you know, how they represent themselves. They could be a little bit softer, a little bit more blush, yeah. a little bit um, deeper. Um, just imagine what it's going to be in your garden. I mean, look at that. I mean, that is just so pretty. It's like this effervescent glow of pink. Oh, gosh. I love so it. Fun, I huh? I'm somebody who loves pink, so that just makes me so happy. <laughs> you know what else? And they get pretty. They get pretty big, too. Yeah. So they can really fill in a great space. Yeah, they're going to get a few feet. Um, they're going to, like, a three feet uh, wide and tall. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're, they're going to be pretty substantial as they age. I like that. You know what, Rochelle? A lot of women, a lot, not just women, a lot of people love roses. And what you're seeing right here is the four-piece easy color miniature roses. You're getting all four of them. They're, it's called the Baby Elizabeth, the Beauty Secret, the Bridal Sunblaze, and the Golden Sunblaze. You're getting all four of them and they come like this. I'll show you, this is yep. where they start and you can see what ours have started to grow into. All four for yes. $19.95. You can get them on free shipping. And remember, they're shipped to you when they're ready to be planted into the ground. So you don't have to worry about what if the weather's not right. But uh, Rochelle, talk to us about these. These are, I mean, these have been so popular um, and there's a good reason for that. That's because roses in the garden, I mean, it's what most gardeners uh, strive for, but roses, um, if you're uh, any, any sort of level of gardener, you might kind of know that roses can be tricky and they can be hard to grow. But the thing about it is, is that these are not like your typical roses. Those are, uh, these are um, what we call landscape roses, which are uh, smaller. They are um, on a rootstock that is much hardier. So they're going to be uh, hardy in the winter. That means they're gonna overwinter all the way from north to south. Uh, but also these are actually grown for their landscape use rather than their cut flower use. So a mm. lot of times um, you might see a rose garden and it kind of isn't the prettiest thing because rose plants aren't really known for being attractive landscape plants. We grow them just for the flower. Landscape roses are a little different. These mini roses, their roses are in these big sprays. So like each stem has uh, like a whole handful of little uh, flowers. They're not as big, but they're covered in these flowers. So you get a lot of color. You get a nice, neat and tidy mound of foliage, which is another thing you don't get with regular roses. But the best part about them is that these are, uh, I mentioned that hardier stock. They're also not as inclined to get um, bothered by um, fungus and pests and stuff, that, which is, uh, you know, a, a big problem with a lot of the more um, antique roses and all these other roses that you might hear about. So if you're a gardener who wants to try your hand at roses, this is the way to go because these are like the easy roses. They're the ones that are just not going to require you to, you know, have an encyclopedic knowledge of horticulture <laughs> to make them be successful, that you're going to be able to plant them. I would plant them, by the way, kind of in the front of the bed because they don't get terribly tall. They just get, you know, maybe two feet at the most. Um, but they're, you want to be able to see all these gorgeous flowers. So I would put them right down in front and put something like the pink mully grass behind them to set mm. them off. And you've got a beautiful display. Oh, I like that idea. I love, and they, they really are stunning. And you, everything you were saying about traditional rose bushes are right. The flower's pretty, the bush, not so much. But these, just the way that they are lower to the ground, they're just tighter, they're so beautiful. And remember, with everything from leaf and petal that you buy, you're going to get real information about yeah. how to care for them and what to expect from them. So and that's also a big the deal. guarantee that which, which is key. Um, the pink, um, I'm sorry, the the roses and the mullet grass are perennials, and the um, the Sansevieria, the snake plant, is an annual. These are uh, plants that so we have guarantees for annuals. They are uh, 90 days, which is basically the growing season. If it's an outdoor plant, that will get you all the way into the fall. But for our perennials, like these roses that's a full year. So if you are in a place where the winters are really strong and you kind of worry that maybe it, 
you know, might not come back after a really cold winter, you don't need to worry because if it doesn't come back next year, you can call us up. You just get that number right off the back of that brochure there and call us up and we'll replace it. Um, also call if you're having any problems whatsoever. If it's not performing like you think it should or if there's any problem with it, it's um, got some pests, whatever. We're, we've got great really educated gardeners there to answer the phone and give you the information, answer your questions and help you out, which is just not something you can say for pretty much um, most places where you buy plants. Uh, they just true. don't come with that level of support. So um, very take terrible. advantage of that if you buy some leaf and petal plants, not just uh, the roses, but anything. Um, ask us questions, call yes. us up, we'll help you out. And you know what, Rochelle, I'm glad you mentioned that because it just gives all of us a sigh of, yes, I can do this. And if I need help, yeah. they're there to help me. I wanted to yes. show you one other item as well. Um, and this is also from Leaf and Petal. This is the 50 count of plant food concentrate. So I'm gonna open this up and show you because it doesn't, this is it. This okay. is a packet and you're getting 50 of these. And I just, um, these are your plant food. So it's a formulation of nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. And it's, yep. it's you don't, I don't need to mix anything. It's not gonna stain my fingers. And do I, um, you can see, you just drop it into the water and. Yep. And it dissolves and, it dis and that's it. So one gallon of water for one pot. It's super simple. You don't have to worry about measuring it. Just, you know, if you have like a recycled milk jug or something is an easy thing. So you can very easily measure it out. And what's great about this is you can use it on all kinds of plants. So you can use it on edibles. You can use it on your garden plants. You can okay. use it on your house plants. It is really an all purpose uh, fertilizer. Right. And it isn't going to burn your plants. If you've ever okay. used a fertilizer that, you know, maybe uh, isn't as well balanced as this one. Yeah. Or is specialized for something you can actually burn your plants so you can't do that with this so that's really great Rochelle thank you so much for You're educating welcome. us and you take care and we'll see you again all right well thank you take care <laughs> bye I bye -bye. love it so anything from leaf and petal that you wanted to pick up the roses the pink mully grass the snake plants or the plant food we've got that for you the rest of this hour we're dedicating to ice cream and it's so funny, I was just talking to my mom uh, literally yesterday and we were, I was reminding her that she used to make homemade ice cream every now and then when I was growing up. But she didn't make it as often as we liked because it took a long time with those old school ice cream makers. Although it was always the best tasting ice cream you ever had. Enter Kitchen HQ, one and a half quarts ice cream maker. You can have sorbet or ice cream in between 15 and 25 minutes. So by the time you get a taste for ice cream, you've got it. For less than $30, red, black, or teal, it even comes with a recipe booklet that gives you um, recipes for various kinds of ice cream, and we're gonna help you out with this. Kelly Diedring is standing by. Kelly, thanks for hanging in with us, and it looks like you're gonna be about to make some ice cream. Tamra, welcome to my kitchen. It's ice cream central today. <laughs> How are you? I'm doing great. So it's ice cream Friday, is it? <laughs> it's ice cream Friday, but it's really ice cream every day when you can do it homemade. This is by Kitchen HQ, Tamra, and I've never seen a better priced ice cream maker. You're getting a one and a half gallon ice cream maker. All you do is freeze the base and you can see this one just finished. So we were trying to time them so that they finished right as we were going on air so that you could see the consistency that comes out of these machines. Now, this vanilla, Tamara, would you guess how many ingredients? How, uh, oh gosh, I don't know. <laughs> guess, three. Uh, five, three? Three ingredients, ingredients that you already have at home. You got half and half or a milk base, right? So whether you want to do a soy milk or an almond milk, and then sugar and vanilla, and oh, that's it. Oh, so wow. this is something that everybody already has, you know, sort of in their homes. Um, and I know a lot of people, and I don't know about yourself, Tamara, I know you're a healthy eater, but a lot of people are stress baking. <laughs> you know, if you're doing the cookies <laughs> or the banana bread, yeah. why not make stress ice cream, right? Because there's <laughs> right. nothing better than fresh ice cream. And mm. many of us, have never had it. We've only ever bought the gallons of ice cream from the grocery store and they're good, don't get me wrong, but they're filled with lots of junk like chemicals, preservatives, maybe they use sugar and you would prefer a sugar substitute like a stevia or something like that. Now you can control your ingredients with the most beautiful, decadent, fresh homemade ice cream. This one's a vanilla, 
but there's a little hole in the top of the machine. I'll show you it to you right here, where as it's spinning, you can add in things like chocolate chips, your kid's favorite candy bar chunked up. You can add in these little cream cookies. The sky's the limit with this machine. You got to get it home and try it because usually ice cream makers are well over $100. Yes, they are. And they're big and they're loud and they're kind they're of lovely. time consuming. This is, Kelly, did I read right? 15 to 25 minutes and I'm done? Yes, 15 to 25 minutes from start. Now, you can see the consistency of my ice cream is like a soft serve, okay? So if you like a soft serve, you don't have to do anything, okay? You freeze the base. I like to say overnight, but you know, if you throw it in there five or six hours before you'll be making ice cream, it'll freeze. But I just keep mine in the freezer at all times because you never know when there's an emergency and you want <laughs> fresh homemade ice cream, right? That's right? I mean, we're going through the, one of the most stressful times that we've ever been through. Why not? Instead of stress baking, do these yes. beautiful fresh ice creams, you know, because some of us have, maybe it's a gluten allergy or you prefer not to have full sugar. Maybe you, you have a family member that can't have dairy at all. You could use an almond milk substitute or a soy milk or a coconut milk. And those kind of ice creams are almost impossible to find in the grocery store. That's right, but you can find it here. I mean, well, you can yes. actually make it and you even get a recipe book. So if you're saying, I wouldn't know where to start, you just follow the recipes. And with things that you very likely already have, just so you know, a lot of you are picking it up in red. We still have black, we still have teal. We even have some here that I'm gonna dive into, but it just <laughs> makes the creamiest, the most decadent, it in ice cream because it's the ice cream that is what you want not what you could the only thing you could find in the store we're going to go back to kelly to see more because yes. these are the things these are the, the little things that make this time a lot easier to swallow Oh my gosh, if you have kids or grandkids in the house, this is so much fun for kids. I mean, they just think it's the greatest thing to add in, you know, let's say for example our chocolate, two egg yolks, a cup a little bit of heavy cream, sugar, and cocoa powder. That's five ingredients, many of which you already probably have in your kitchen. You whisk it together, right? And so the kids can get involved, the grandkids. Uh, maybe you've never made this. Maybe it's the husband that thinks it's really cool or whatever the case may be. It'll look like this when it's a base, right? And then all you do is pour it into the machine. You hit the on switch, okay? And so I wanna show you what happens. This is our raspberry, but like with my chocolate, I, I hit that on switch and it just starts to spin, okay? and it's starting to freeze because you have your base that's completely frozen. So that's all there is to it. And you said 15 to 25 minutes. It's usually closer to that 15, 20 minute mark. And you have completely beautiful, fresh, homemade ice cream with your ingredients. I like to skip the sugar sometimes. Maybe add some honey or agave as my sweetener. Maybe I use stevia. Um, you know, it's up to you. The other thing is a lot of people like a rock hard ice cream. My recommendation is just to take it out and put it in a container like this right out of your machine. And then you get that rock hard sort of ice cream like the ice cream shop does. Uh, you only need 15 or 20 minutes. Uh, inside your freezer and you get that sort of grocery store ice cream shop consistency. Mm -hmm. But for me, Tamara, and I don't know about you, but I prefer the soft serve. I like it soft coming right out and going right into my mouth. I do too. <laughs> and I like, and I'm with you. I don't like the regular dairy. I like a different kind of sweetener. Um, yeah. And maybe for you, the, the fact that it's one and a half quarts means you could literally make a different flavor of ice cream every day because you're not buying the big gallon where you have to wait till you get to the bottom. And so it's a little portion control Kelly, right? A little less guilt. It's so true, though. It really is less guilt. So, I mean, like I'm saying, me and my friends, we're all doing all these baking. Everybody's, so I'm getting recipe swap ideas all the time. Why not make it ice cream this time or freeze it into ice cream sandwiches, right? It's not technically baking, but my goodness, it's that <laughs> sweet treat, that delicious treat. This is a raspberry sorbet. Okay, you know, how many times you go to the shop and you're like, okay, I'd like a, a little bit healthier of an option. This one just has raspberry sugar. You could add a bit of gelatin and then some um, of your favorite, uh, like if you want to do like a lemon, a little bit of a lemon in there and raspberries. And that's it. That's all you have to do. And, and you've got this beautiful, um, you know, treat for your friends, treat for your family. And it's healthy again, right? Because we right. didn't have to add in all the garbage. That's right. You know everything that's in it because I'll tell you if you if you actually read the back of a traditional ice cream container 
you would be shocked <laughs> at what's in yeah. there. But if you're, we're trying to take better care of ourselves, but we don't want to give up our treats. So this is a way where you don't have to, you just make it your way. And your way, your family's way, whatever the case is, I'm going to do a little couple of little sprinkles on there just to make it a little <laughs> bit more festive. Because Kelly, when it's this easy, how could you not? Yes, it's so true. How could you not? And I have to say, literally, I've banished my family outside, and then my five-year-old came running when he saw me <gasps> making ice cream cones. So, <gasps> can you say hi? Take the ice cream cone, because he, I mean, it's so much fun, right? <laughs> for our friends, for our family, he's going to run off with that ice cream and go, no, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. But you know what? You feel good giving it to him, too. Kelly, thank you so much for letting Tanya, us come into your you. home. thank you. You take care. Oh, and thank for, you. I'll see you later. Definitely. And for all of you who are calling in, especially for that red, go ahead and get it. Red, black, or teal. We'd love to send it to you. All right. And then every day can be ice cream Sunday. All right. We are going to take a quick